Are you growing seeds plants and cuttings? And you are confused about the best pot for them? Don't worry, this video will help you. In gardening, pot selection is a very important and valuable step that should be taken out very wisely. We can't grow everything in the same type of pot. All of the plants have different requirements of pot, soil, and environment. A perfect pot is responsible for the healthy growth of plants. In a 5 inches pot, you can't grow bigger size fruit plants. For the vegetable gardening, you also needs to choose a perfect pot wisely. If you select a good pot for the plant, your plant also gives you good quality results. Many times, we choose a wrong pot and also a wrong environment to grow something, and when it doesn't grow we became disheartened. Gardening is all about learning and growing yourself. In this video, I am going to show you an easy way to choose a good pot for any plant that fulfills all its requirements. Every container or pot have its benefits and disadvantages. So, we can't choose a single type of pot for every plant. If you follow my steps, none of your plant will die. The material of the pot is important as well as its size. Some plants require small pot and some requires larger pot. It is up to you to give perfect pot to your plants. Let's start from our first container that is a seedling tray. It is made up of plastic material. Many of our pots are made up of plastic material. Using plastic is not so easy. They requires a larger care about soil mix, environment and watering. Plastic material don't let the air to pass through it, and passage of air is very important for healthy roots. Clay pot have small pores in its surface that allow water and air to pass. Plastic seedling trays are not recommended to grow seeds. I always use clay pots to grow seeds. Seeds requires heat and moisture to germinate themselves. From the plastic material, the moisture drains very slowly that can harm your seeds. You can use seedling trays in the shady place. In the sunlight, the plastic becomes very hot that make your seedlings to fail. Seedling tray have only 2 inches space in it to add soil and seeds. You can't grow larger plants in it. Don't use seedling trays in hot summers. High temperature makes the tray to heat up that is very harmful for seeds. If you wants to grow seeds, use this type of clay pot. It is very easy to germinate seeds in a clay pot. Clay pot have small irrigation pores in it that allow the air to pass. Soil in such type of pots dries very fastly. So, you have to be careful about watering process. Clay pot is made up of soil, so it is more natural for seeds to grow in it. In summers, the soil dries very fastly from this type of pot. So, you can use small amount of cocoa peat in the soil mix. It will help the soil to retain moisture in it. In this container, seedlings overlap their roots that is very harmful at transplant time. So, you can place the seeds at some difference. Don't overlap the seeds at sowing time. Did you have these type of plastic pots? You can use them to grow seasonal flowers like gazania, petunia, pansy, marigold, etc. 5 to 7 inches pots are very ideal for seasonal flowering plants. Plastic pots like these are best for growing winter flowers because the flowering plants needs to be placed in sunlight. In summer sunlight, the temperature is very high that makes the plastic pot to heat up. Winter sunlight is not so harmful for that. But you should have to be very careful about the watering of winter flowers in plastic pots. In plastic pots, the moisture dries very slowly and cause fungal attack. For the vegetable gardening, You can use these type of larger clay pots. 12 inches pots are ideal for vegetable gardening. Vegetable plants grows very healthily in such type of pots. Clay pots have a very good drainage system, but in summers, you have to be very careful about watering. In clay pots, the water dries fastly. You can use cocoa peat in your soil mix for retaining moisture in the soil. Good irrigation pot helps to grow good quality vegetables. You should must use clay pots for vegetables. Many times, we paint our plastic pots to make them more beautiful. These type of oil paints are very harmful for the soil mix as well as roots. If you have these type of pots, don't use them. You can use other planters. Growing vegetables in such type of planters is also very harmful. 
The oil paints have harmful effects on the quality of fruit and vegetables. Always use clay pots for growing healthy fresh vegetables. For growing fruit plants like pomegranate, berries, and other grafted fruit plants, you can use these type of larger pots that allow the roots to grow freely in them. If you are using plastic containers, make sure your soil is not wet. Plastic pots always retain more moisture and don't let it to dry. So, you should be very careful about watering process. By following these tips you can grow healthy fresh plants. Now your plants will grow more fastly and happily. If you are new to this channel, press subscribe button for gardening videos.